Okay, here's my the Hymax fan. You have to pardon all my caulking on the side here. Um, I don't know how well you can see this, but right on the tips of the rotor, you can see where it was rubbing on my uh, inlet ducting, which I had just on the inside of the uh, fan housing. A poor idea on my part. I was in a hurry, and I should have found a way to get it around the outside of it. Uh, let's see here. So uh, the way it's rubbing uh, slightly in on the rotor blade makes me think that my inlet ducting may have been collapsing just a little as it was kind of thin when it entered the fan housing um, because the inlet ducting was right up against the fan housing when I, you know, when I put it in here, but it looks like it's come in a couple millimeters or maybe the uh, rotor blades stretched uh, because it was being pushed pretty hard on 10 and 12 S. Um, so the rotor blades could have stretched out and been pulled slightly forward, I guess. Um, also, the motor, there, there's just no room at all for a heat sink on the motor. The Hymax motor comes with the heat sink, uh, which also kind of holds it in, you know, squarely in place. But, um, I don't know if you can see, I can probably see down through here. And the Hymax fan has the, the heat sink on the outside of the motor casing built into the motor casing, uh, which gets a good bit of air. You can see down through next to the motor housing, between the motor and the motor housing, there's a good bit of uh, room for cooling air to get in there. So anyway, uh, bummer I couldn't get a, a heat sink on the outside of the Medusa to slide up in there. That would have really helped out, I'm sure. And the uh, Put your inlet ducting around the outside. Don't put it on the inside. Um, and I think this would have worked out real well. Here's the Medusa right next to the uh, the Hymax. Um, now the the Hymax is like an 1850 kV, and not you know it's rated to run at at 6s. I tested up to 8s, but it's really it's only suggested to run to 8S. Uh, the uh, Medusa one, naturally I was running at about three times its rated wattage um, and it may have been fine had the rotors not you know been rubbing on the on the inlet ducting uh, and if, an, if I had been able to get a uh, heat sink around the outside Probably not a good idea to run it at three times its rated capacity and not have a heat sink on it. So there you have it.